you have to mine it and get it later now it does take time to make money from those and difficulty does go up i'm just keep saying it in almost every video and i want to tell you it again when you buy something like this and you see the numbers you have to understand that difficulty goes up which means you get less and eventually eventually just like the s7 and other machines right now even the s9 doesn't make money anymore their value goes down a lot and a lot of it is also because of the electricity price this machine takes 1410 watts out of the wall it produced 7.8 terahashes on mining Blake 256 R14 script and it can mine Decred and maybe some other coins and we're gonna do unboxing and then do the setup and see how much we can make but again whatever we make it's gonna decrease over time so make sure you calculate that always do research before investing guys please alright so let's do the unboxing So this is definitely a big miner, which means it's gonna be loud and big. You need a, uh, you know, you need a good place for it. I have a garage to test it on, but make sure you have the correct place for it. Oh, nice! This is a, a little bigger uh, paper as usual. Um, and now it comes with two papers. Usually it comes one paper from Bitcoin. Always the packaging is always very well. I always like it the way Bitmain packages, they actually have pretty good packaging and never really had any problem but just in case I'm gonna do some testing so let's take it out of the box oh wow now it's sealed too so okay here it is um, yep it's brand new and uh, DR3 7.8 terahashes this is the intake, this is where the air comes out and I'm gonna do a gentle shake uh, gently just to make sure that uh, there's no heat sink loose sometimes they get loose and if you turn it on when the heat sink loose you're gonna burn the machine so pretty standard I see an uh, internet connection right here you have SD card slot nobody uses that there's a reset there that you do use and the IP report um, and that's about it here is my Z9 Mini, it's usually on because it's still profitable, but right now it's off so I can show you guys how to install the DR3. This is my first time installing the DR3, so you basically are doing it together with me for the first time. The first thing I'm going to do is plug in the network cable. It doesn't really matter uh, which one you do first, as long as all of them are on. Now we're going to need 10 VGA cables, one for the motherboard, for the main board of the DR3 and then three for each board for a total of 10. Be very gentle when you connect the power cables. Now we plug in the rest of the cables to the hashing boards. Okay, it's all plugged in, so I'm gonna turn it on. It will be very loud. Before I plug it in, I'm gonna use a filter. Those filters are awesome. It protects the mining from uh, getting any bugs or any dirt and you just have to clean them up once a month or so because this thing a lot of air go through it and yeah check the link below for one of those filters it's magnetic it just goes to the back no screws needed no you don't need to void warranty to use it or anything like that now let's turn it on it's gonna be very loud and i actually almost forgot you need the this one this is a jumper to make the power supply think it's in a motherboard case so we're gonna have to have that too in order to end money to turn on so in order for the power to turn on Okay, let's turn it on. It's gonna be loud, just like the S9. So, first thing to do is to download the port scanner, the advanced port scanner. We're gonna install it and then we're gonna find the IP address that's now associated with this ant miner. Once that's done, we'll be able to log into that miner and be able to change the settings. And we're gonna choose a pool. I actually don't know anything about Decred coin or how to mine this thing. So we're gonna learn together. I'm gonna find some pools. Um, maybe we'll use some alternative pools like NiceHash. We'll see. All right, so I think I found it. Um, 192.168.1.36 your your IP address might be different every time it connects it it chooses a different address so it might be a different address for you root is the username root is the password we are connected dr3 
mining stat is great 7.7 7.8 average pretty good everything is mining great temperatures looks great about 78 less than 80 degrees celsius looks good so now we have to go ahead and change the pool right now it's btc.com pool of course it's gonna go to uh Ant miners, it's gonna go back to beat mine. We're gonna change it to our pool. So let's see what kind of pools they have that supports Decred. So I actually found out that Nice has supports Blake 256 R14 in US. So I'm gonna try to use those settings, but a lot of times it might not work for us. You either get unstable hashing rates or no hashing rate at all. But let's give it a try. I'm just gonna try it out because just the easiest way, fastest way to figure out how much we can we make quickly. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy the stratum address and the username and the password. So the stratum address is going to be all the same. I'm going to go ahead and copy my Bitcoin address for NiceHash and use it as the username. And the password is X. I do recommend to have more than one pool. This is all the same pool address, but you want to have different pool addresses in case one of them fail. Let's give it a try and wait 10 minutes and see if it's going to hash. While I'm waiting for this to hash and start with the ant miner, I'm going to go ahead and look at other pools. This is a top 10 uh, pools here, top 12. Uh, that mine with the decred which is blake 256r14 and i'm gonna try to get with the best one because most likely that's a better one uh, not always but i'm just gonna go with the one that's most popular so this one is bpool.org this is actually in chinese but i translated it uh, it's basically said you can open a wallet by downloading a wallet you add your uh, mining pool address that's for their pool all you have to do after that is just add your address your wallet address and start mining so that sounds pretty cool that's pretty easy so let's uh, let's go ahead and see if it supports nice hash as i suspected nice hash doesn't really support decred or this dr3 mining so we're gonna have to create our own wallet which i did with bitrx i created a wallet i'm gonna copy that wallet and use it as my username i'm gonna call it dot dr3 that's my user sub user address i'm going to change the url to a different pool i'm going to use the uh the chinese uh bpool.org just because it's the most popular so I, you know i'll give it a try definitely don't marry to one pool i do change some pools around some pools pay more some pools pay less some pools have more or less downtime maybe you want to make your own pool if you have enough dr3s like hundreds of them or so you can open your own pool and then avoid the fees but yeah i mean the fees are not too bad for this um if we take a look at the fee it's uh the minimum paint is 0.1 decred and it doesn't really show the fee one or two percent or so so it's not bad so we can definitely give it a try we're gonna go ahead and mine it uh not as solo we're gonna go ahead and mine it in a pool i'm just gonna go ahead and google decred mining calculator i'm gonna put in the numbers and see how much money we can make uh currently of course this changes and uh obviously difficulty goes up always thousands of people is gonna receive this dr3 right now so let's go ahead and calculate it we are mining 7800 giga hashes or 7.8 tera hashes our power is 1420 watts my cost is about 20 cents per kilowatt hours let's go ahead and calculate it and my cost for electricity is very high $200 my cost for electricity so I'm gonna make about $100 a month so it's about the same as the Z9 pretty much but it's a lot louder and if you pay less electricity for example if you pay only 10, 10 cents per kilowatt hours you're gonna make double the profit so you see how that's gonna help you a lot with the profit okay let's see if we can start mining here let's see if it's gonna work yep right away it start mining I can see it um, let's see if we can actually follow up with our uh, pool and we can see if um, if we see our mining um, information, if we can see our mining status. I'm guessing this is where I'm going to put my address and view my status. Um, yep, it's already started to mine. It's showing 450 giga hashes and obviously it's going to go up as you, we wait and we're going to get more hashing power. DR3, here it is, 450 giga hashes and it's going to go up. So yep, everything works fine and we managed to set up the mining pool and show you guys how much profit you're going to make. 